One of my new favorite biohacks is ozone therapy, O3 versus O2, which is oxygen therapy. It's more direct healing at the cellular levels, depending on the result you're looking for, depending on what parameters or settings you'll actually use. Some people have specific health issues like Lyme disease, mold exposure, whereas others may be just looking to detox, lose weight, anti-aging, skin health, or just recovery from workout. The way it works is you sit in there, kind of like a wet sauna, so that steam mixes with carbon dioxide to create what's called carbonic acid, so it dilates more blood vessels throughout the body. Then you have more blood flow, thus it introduces the ozone, the O3, to expedite getting to more parts of the body. This is where the key comes into play. This connected with infrared light, PMF, pulse electric magnetic field, which goes in there, activates that cellular membrane. Again, our cells sometimes may not be doing their job, and that cellular membrane, if it's not allowing nutrients to go in, or in this case, ozone, or toxins, waste to go out, it's not actually getting the results that you're looking for. And that's where you're looking at energy, immunity, and just overall the anti-aging effects that you're wanting. So when it comes to it, ozone therapy is powerful. And it's this machine that actually goes in there and does all these systems as far as getting them activated at once that gives you the result in a lot faster manner. So depending on your, again, result that you're looking for, or depend on the actual parameters that you suit. You sit in there for about 30 minutes, nice and relaxed, calms the nervous system down, but at the end of the day, it gets you the result you want a lot faster in a better manner than what you do trying to do each one individually by themselves.